the bald and the beautiful. They know all about you. Everything from Nashville to Hollywood on My Country 96.1. 818, Ashley Monroe hit up Twitter yesterday with an update on her battle with cancer. Things are looking up. She says, my blood work looked amazing and normal, and so did my scans. So awesome news for Ms. Monroe. Charitable donations can be tax deductible. Keep that in mind. I'll tell you the story that Chris Stapleton has two prize packages up for bid that could get you an autographed bottle of E.H. Taylor bourbon or perhaps tickets to his All-American Roadshow Tour. Packages are at CharityBuzz.com. One bid already over $10,000. We're talking a lot about who's hosting and performing at Monday's ACMs, but we've kind of passed by the part that it's airing on Amazon Prime this year for the first time. So if you don't have it, or even if you do, you can check out a step-by-step -step guide on how to watch it. The uh, website is musicmayhemmagazine.com. Pete Davidson might be jo joining Jeff Bezos on a Blue Origin flight into space. A source said, quote, they haven't signed a contract yet, but it looks really good. Suzanne Summers has made $300 million off of the Thighmaster over the year. She says, quote, we stopped counting when we sold $10 million of them, but they continue to sell and sell. The Batman hits theaters today. Robert Pattinson as the Dark Knight this will be one of the darkest Batmans ever. And uh, runs for about three hours. Zoe Kravitz as Catwoman, Pete Dano, or Paul Dano, rather, as the Riddler. Would you like to portray Madonna in her upcoming, uh, upcoming biopic? It's a grueling audition process. Includes boot camp with up to 11 hours of choreography training. Then later will require readings with Madonna, as well as a singing audition. New kids on the block, Rick Astley and Vogue Salt Pepper, all, all, all hitting the road together. It's called the Mixtape Tour. And they just released a new song with a video that recreates classic videos. We're not going to take it and addict it to love. And that will begin on May 10th. New music out today includes Run, Rose, Run, Dolly Parton. It's the soundtrack to her novel of the same name that she co-wrote with best-selling author James Patterson. Album features 12 original songs. The novel is out Monday, the same day that she'll be co-hosting the 57th Annual Country Music Awards. Also out today on the countryside, Jenny Tolman married in a honky-tonk. This is her second album. Girl Country Anthems for National Women's Month. Okay, Man, I Feel Like a Woman makes this list, as does Dolly Parton's 9 to 5. Casey Musgraves' Follow Your Arrow. And speaking of following your arrow on National Women's Month, who is the female artist that has inspired Marin Mars the most? There are many women that have shaped me as not just an artist or writer, but as a woman myself. Dolly Parton is a huge one for me um, in all the ways. I think I've read every bit of literature there is available on the woman, and I've gotten to work with her a couple times over the last few years, and she's just everything you would expect and more. Ruth Bader Ginsburg, uh, I mean, I just feel like there's so many ballsy women that have shaped me and made me fearless. And hopefully, you know, my name will be up there for some little girl someday. And at 822, that is your Bald and Beautiful Entertainment Report. Fathead and Candy in the morning, weekdays 6 to 10 a.m. on My Country 96.1.